Yo, what's up? This is Prof. Yo, man. I thought of something that I have had to explain to people at different times. You know, it's the whole, I think it, therefore I am, uh, method, you know, method or theory that applies itself that, you know, to where a person can feel like, if I can envision myself doing this or being this, Therefore, I am because I can envision it or I can if I can see it and envision it, then I can achieve it and make it happen. I tell people like, you know, that's OK to be like that if it helps you in the form of confidence, perseverance and, you know, um, it, uh, waves off procrastination and it helps you to achieve stuff. But then at the same time, there's a sense of reality. And, you know, what makes people think that you're crazy is when the reality aspect of whatever you're talking about or your argument um, doesn't make any sense. Because it's just as well as if you see me and I have a black, uh, you know, skull cap, ski cap baseball cap or whatever the hell on my head and you see that it is black but I keep trying to for whatever damn reason tell you that no it's really orange and you're looking like what the fuck are you talking about man and I'm trying to come in all kind of different situations and and, 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 and theoretical perceptions uh, uh, different dimensions of thought and whatever look motherfucker how are we talking? We are speaking English, right? We are living in America, right? Um, do you think that pertaining to color, you know, like if a person, if, if, if I have a black cap on, a person is going to think, and I'm trying to tell you, no, it's orange. Okay. And, and, and let's say if I was to break out and say, well, in Russia, it would be considered orange. We're not in Russia. See, that's some bullshit. And people be doing dumb shit like that sometimes. You got to watch that. See, and I would say like, when we entered, I think when we entered the new millennium, you start having people, things, situations that are controlled by people where the powers that be started coming with this whole implementation of, uh, uh, of different ways of perceiving and thinking about things to cause confusion, you know? So you know, see, it's just like a person who doesn't like laws, rules, structure. The reason why people don't like stuff like that is because they want to basically be able to do what the hell they want to, when they want to, how they want to. When you have rules, regulations, and structure, it means that those rules and regulations and that structure applies itself to where you can't go outside of, you know, the parameters of what that, you know, uh, those rules and instructions are. And people that don't like that, they 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 like they like chaos and stuff and disorder because it, it allows for them to one, like not be held accountable and responsible. And then with the, all the chaos that also comes about, the whole thing about it, those type of people will look at that chaos as being exciting, uh, you know, um, entertaining, killing like mundane type of uh, uh, situations or atmosphere. That's the reason why, like you see in the hood, you have people that will stay in them um, uh, uh, housing projects, people that stay around um, where there, there's, there's a high crime area, places like that. And it'd be like, yo, you see people, um, be in their house. You can hear some people outside. They'll say, yo! T-Dog nipped down on the corner fighting. Motherfucker be like, did you hear that shit? And they'll start tearing up at the house. Running, what's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Where he at? 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 You see motherfuckers asking people, what's up? What's up? What? Okay. These fools might be down there doing who the fuck knows what. Somebody might have pulled out a fucking strap. You gonna go run down there with the fuck there? Check this out. And seeing that, here's the killer thing about uh, 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 about something that refutes what 
some comedians be saying. Now, you know, maybe maybe um some some white people can look at this and say, wait a minute, what? Like, hmm, if they choose to, but I'm just but but this is all about keeping it real. And saying that, you know how those comedians always be telling jokes talking about how oh uh white people will always run to danger and run to situations and they'll see everybody running and they, instead of them running with everybody else, they'll run to where the problem is and then they'll get fucked up and beat down and all that. Okay, see, I'm I I I've heard these like trying to use them like wait, wait, hold on, wait, 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 wait. Why? Well, okay, well all the laughs is going and everything. Let's be fucking real. Motherfuckers be in the hood running to fucking bullshit, like like to see fights. Motherfuckers pulling out gats, all kind of fucking shit, beating motherfuckers with baseball bats, doing all kind of shit. Uh 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 uh. uh. You know, all the damn fucking time. They don't, motherfuckers don't be just staying in the house or or staying away from them. Motherfuckers will come right outside their damn house when they hear all the drama and fight. They go, ooh, ooh, look at it. And then everybody's standing around. I'm talking about grown motherfuckers. I'm talking about grandparents. 50-year-old motherfuckers. Damn near 60-year-olds sitting up there watching fucking youngsters getting out there scrapping. And they standing on the damn side talking about, get his ass. Get him. Get him. Whoop his ass. Whoop his ass. Yeah, that's right, motherfucker. Yeah, do it, do it. Got their grandsons, granddaughters. Motherfucker in the hood. Killing thing about it is, goddamn, you got these damn females be all out there beating the fuck out of each other and shit like that. And everybody just standing around like, yeah, yeah. Pull her here, Kwanda. Pull her here. Yeah, kick that bitch. Kick that bitch. Like, what the fuck? I mean, come on, man. You know, now, if people keep seeing shit like that and seeing all that damn dysfunction, and then they start saying, well, we know this. At least that picture of black people or that image as it applies itself to, you know, being com commonly seen in those type of areas. And that gets projected some kind of way, whether whether you put it in the whether you whether you put it in the hood to hood movies, whether you put it all on the Internet, uh, whether you put it all on uh, um, Facebook Live and all that fucking shit. Then when people start to looking at this, come on, man, fuck this shit. Like, this is black motherfuckers, you know what I'm saying? And you come to the store and they all like, any, any motherfucker you got, uh, the dude at the counter, hello? Hello, can I help you? You ever see that shit? The motherfucker killing me with that shit, though. As soon as we walk in the store, the, the, the eyes get the bugging. Hello, can I help you? You go looking for whatever through the store. He all looking like beyond the counter. So, man, I've seen that shit where like people's in front, you supposed to be helping them at the counter. This motherfucker like, That'll be twelve ninety seven. You, you, he's supposed to be helping dude over here, but he's looking over here at you and shit. And he like, and then he's still like, "Hello, hello, hello." He, I was just, I was just, somebody might look at you. Yeah, I think the guy's coming. What? Yeah, yeah, yes, yeah, 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 yes. Do you need something? What the fuck? But now I'm just saying that's that's yeah. I know that's some racial profiling shit. I understand that, but I'm just saying. When you think about what these crazy motherfuckers be doing, <laughs> running in them stupid ass ghetto fights and and, and, and like this, I mean, people take that and shit be like, oh, you know, and, and like people take snapshots, and it's not right. But I tell people also, everything in life, it's not about right or wrong. It's just all you can really do is look at it as being fucked up. You know what I'm saying? But like I said, yo man, in life, it, it, it's like. Um, everything that, you know, you can't just say, if I think it, therefore I, I, I can do it, you know, or, or, or I can be it or whatever. No, no, the fuck you can't, man. You know what I'm saying? If somebody knows something truthfully more than you, you should defer to them to get knowledge. The smart, intelligent person is the person who seeks out knowledge. Not the motherfucker that keeps running his mouth all the goddamn time trying to appear like some fake-ass intellectual when, truthfully, when you was back in school, you didn't even give a fuck about scholastic achievement. You are an average-ass student. All the fuck you wanted to do was just fucking get the fuck out of school as fast as you fucking can, and then you either wanted to get a job or get out there on the grind, or you just wanted a lot of freedom just to bullshit so you wouldn't have to think about fucking going to classes all damn day. So don't try this new goddamn, all of a sudden I've been enlightened. The knowledge that I've never had in 20, 30 fucking years has just bam hit the brain. And now the people that do know, 
he's talking to them like either he's on he or she is talking to them as though they're either on their level or they know more than they do. That's just hella. When we talk about the word stupid, now think about that. Here's somebody that could help you who has the true knowledge, but instead of you deferring to them or asking for their understanding or assistance to help you be able to have the knowledge or have the wherewithal to be able to achieve what you wish to achieve, you whether front like you have knowledge you don't have, have a life history that you've never had, done things you've never done. How can you just be like that and then try to justify that even to yourself? You know what I'm saying? So things that you can't truthfully do, stop perpetrating like you can because you can't just use that I think and therefore I am for everything.